As you probably know, auction house flipping is essentially just finding a gap in prices on AH, of course, and which can seem to be pretty easy but appear to be pretty hard. The only hard part with AH flipping is probably just finding the right items to flip to make a decent amount of profit. That's exactly why I'm going to go over what you can flip and make the most of your money and hopefully get rich off of it. Before I get into it, please consider subscribing and liking this video as it supports me a lot. But without any further delay, let's get into it. To start off, if you kind of want to flip like me, definitely go towards pets and dungeon items as that's pretty much all I flip and it's definitely a pretty big category for what you can flip. To start off, if you are a, um, a little bit more broke player, you can definitely stick with cheaper items like adaptive. These are pretty cheap. You can try to find a like 4 star cheap adaptive and then there's like a 500k gap or whatever you can find and make profit off of. But definitely try to go for the cheapest item you can afford and make as much profit as possible off of like armor or weapons that you can afford. If you are a little bit richer player, definitely stick towards Necron or Storm and try to flip these yet again with the stars. Just look through the AH and try to find a cheap 4 star that you could flip. Lastly for dungeon items, if you are a richer player you can do what I do and I practically just look through AH trying to look through 5 star mythic items. I'm, I don't, I'm not on forge so I can't use my mods but essentially you just look through 5 star items and you're actually going to look for pretty good um, ultimate enchants for example if this was five star and you know last stand five and the next one was like you know five mil profit or whatever you can find you can do that now the thing with this is that you will make the most profit but you might have a little bit difficult time selling these items you should be fine though if you make it the cheapest as of right now i'm flipping these two as you can see i probably need to refresh these and make sure i am the cheapest but i probably made roughly 5 mil off of each of these so that's 10 mil and then I also have this one which I made a mistake I thought it was uh, Necron or when it didn't sell the first time and I didn't hop on for a bit I thought it was Necron so I need to repost this for cheaper I'll probably make I don't know 5 mil profit off of this as well though and you can also do weapons um, for any of these like I said for the first one uh, I do do I do Juju as well, which also makes me quite a bit of money, and it's less risky because Juju sells pretty quickly. Alright, moving on to pets, you're really just going to look at a higher level than the rest, and then, you know, for a cheaper price, and then just find the find a level very similar to it, and then sell it for that price. Now, I'm just, this is just an example. Uh, you can flip these probably, maybe if you can find the right um, item. But if you are a uh, more poor player definitely go for cheaper pets and you know try to make up more money and then flip bigger pets for bigger money if you are a richer player of course you can flip you know more expensive items and find bigger gaps in items of course um which will definitely make a huge change in how much money you make and of course if you have a lot of money you can find whatever pet will make you the most money if you can afford it and of course lastly just a quick little um kind of bonus little thing uh, if you are definitely a little bit more broke and you don't even have one mil, I definitely recommend trying to win like these dungeon items that sell for a decent bit off of auction and then just post them there. You should be able to make quite a bit of money even though you are bidding a little bit of money. And that's just a quick video on to hopefully help you with auction. I was flipping if you have any like questions. And that's pretty much it. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, yet again, please consider subscribing and liking this video and I'll see you guys later. Peace.